I am, as promised. I knew you would keep your promise after all. I'm sure you've barely been able to take your mind off it these past few days. Have you managed to get any sleep at all? Hmm. สวัสดีครับกลับมาพบกับผมอีกครั้งกับ Old Game Memory นะครับแล้ววันนี้เรากลับมาที่ Genshin Impact กันอีกครั้งนึงครับคือผมกดวาร์ปมาที่นี่ปุ๊บมันเข้าฉากเลยเว้ยผมเลยแบบเอิมโอเคนะ I... You're quite mistaken I would never doubt the leaders of my clan So where is your proof อืมอยู่นี่เลย Ah how wonderful Everyone's keeping their promises today You wouldn't believe what we had to go through to get our hands on this stuff Hand them to Sara She can examine them for herself mm -hmm. What is this? I see this document bears the official seal of the head of the Kujo clan And it doesn't look like forgery I don't understand Not a single word about the resistance, Sangonomiya, or the situation on the front line What about the soldiers who gave their lives on the front line? Or the hardship endured by the people? Do they deserve no mention? Utter disregard for human life. Why would they want to hide it? For the sake of the vision hunt decree, of course. Don't you think the Shogun might reconsider her policy if all of the things you just mentioned appeared in this report? So, the Tenryo Commission... They are deliberately deceiving the Shogun? Yes. Now, who else do you think might be benefiting from the Vision Hunt decree? Mm. This is a letter from the Tenryo Commission to the Fatui. The head of the Kujo Clan kept this a secret from the Shogun too. <sighs> well, the things you wanted to see but also wished not to see are here before you. Surely, you aren't planning to turn a blind eye to them? So everything I've ever held on to. Oh, how could they? Mm. This betrayal is unforgivable. Mm -hmm. Takayuki, you've got some explaining to do. Kujo <laughs> Sara seems pretty angry, huh? Looks like our Tenryo rebellion is successfully underway. Hmm. Yep, yep. Let's catch up with her. Hmm. Hold on, traveler. There's something else we need to discuss. And I left. Last time you entered the plain of Euthymia, it was in front of the statue of the omnipresent god, correct? Mm. You must find a way to recreate the circumstances of that day. If you can get the Raiden Shogun to open her heart to you once more before the statue of the omnipresent god, you will have the opportunity you need. Mm. Take this with you as a farewell gift. What is it? The omamori from the Grand Narukami Shrine are very potent indeed. I thought I'd put one aside for you. Mm. <laughs> If you find yourself at your wit's end, take it out and see what happens. Okay. Maybe your prayers will be answered and all your problems will disappear in the blink of an eye. Mm. Or if you ever think about me during your journey, take it out, won't you? Okay. Who knows? Maybe I'll just end up appearing right in front of you. Mm. Take it out, last lady. This I'm sorry. Well then, time for you to face my hopeless fool of a friend. I'm counting on you. สงสัยนี่ของเป็นการ์ดเรียกตัวแหมแหมเลย You followed me here. Nenon. You 
You've got guts, I'll give you that. Mm -hmm. Since you were a witness, I suppose I can shield you from arrest. At least until I have received an explanation from Takayuki. Mm -hmm. But if it turns out that you have been deceptive in this matter, then not only will you be arrested immediately, but you'll also be charged with one more crime. Mm. Do I make myself clear? Mm. Hmm. Good. Ah. ไม่คิดว่ามันจะเป็นดันเจียนครับโหลดนานนะเนี่ยทําไมโหลดนานอย่างเงี้ยเอ้ยเฮ้ยอือฮึโหลดนานว่ะเฮ้ยเกิดอ
Sarah. But you worship the Shogun. How can you betray her after all this time and act like it's nothing? Betrayal? How can you call this a betrayal? The Fatui may think they are using me, but the reverse is true. What could they possibly hope to achieve? When the lightning strikes in Inazuma, they shall fall to their knees and tremble! Paralyzed by fear and trepidation. After all, none can contend with the supreme power of the almighty Raiden Shogun and the Muso no Hitotachi! Mm. Yeah! She doesn't worship the Raiden Shogun herself, but her power is a warrior. Especially the Muso no Hitotachi. In fact, he seems to be way too into it. But Master... What about loyalty? Ever since I was adopted by the Kujo clan, you taught me the importance of loyalty from servants to their superiors. But it's clear to me now that you wanted my loyalties to stop with the Kujo clan. So you were scared that I would betray you one day? You hypocrite! Preaching about virtue just to mask your own wretched selfishness! Selfishness? I am but safeguarding the eternity of the Kujo clan. I'm quite sure the almighty Shogun would be sympathetic to that. As would the former head of our clan. Uh, hate to say it, but his ego is getting in the way. If he thinks the Kujo clan is a match for the Fatui, Paimon thinks he's in for a nasty surprise. Mm-hmm. I've doubted the Vision Hunt decree in the past. I asked myself, is this truly the correct thing to do? Even though it goes against what I know in my heart to be right. But I chose to obey the Shogun. For as long as she leads the way, who among us is qualified to judge between right and wrong when we have not yet reached the end of the path? But now I realize that the path of eternity is one without end, while this path, it has long since been defiled by your selfish ways. So I'm going to tell the Shogun the truth about all this. Mm -hmm. If nothing else, my conscience will be clear. <laughs> Stubborn and futile. Report to the Shogun if you so wish. The Kujo clan's position is now unshakable, and nothing you can do will change this. Mm -hmm. The Shogun is at Tenshukaku receiving a Shnezhnayan diplomat. A harbinger by the name of Signora. Mm. Signora's the one behind all this? Ugh, not her again! Mm -hmm. Way back in Rito, Lady Hiragi said something about the Kanjo Commissioner meeting with an arrogant sounding woman. <sighs> we should have known. A diplomat from Snezhnaya? Well, if she thinks she's leaving Inazuma in one piece, she's got another thing coming. Mm-hmm. Sarah stormed off! Do you think she's gonna go barge into Tenshikaku right now? Hmm. You can say that again! Mm-hmm. Alright then, let's do this! Ta, bây buộc cái chế nên cần. Ooh, đây còn. Hmm. Hmm. ผมยังเปิดตู้ได้อีกทีหนึ่งหลังคือก่อนที่อันนี้จะหมดนะครับไม่รู้เหมือนกันดูก่อนอถ้าเกิดเก็บครบเก็บครบแล้วยังไม่ได้น้องเขาอีกก็อดแล้วโอ้โหล่วงล่วงกันเป็นแถวนี่ก็ล่วงโอ้โหนอนจูบพื้นกันเป็นแถวดินดินอร่อยไหมพวกเอานี่ก็เป็นดันเจียนเหมือนกันโอเคตาลอยอ
Hm. Hm. สวยแล้วเลือดไม่เต็มด้วย The way people charge in here as they please so uncivilized If I didn't know this was Tenshukaku I might have mistaken it for some kind of street market Have you learned your lesson now The right to punish Inazumans for their crimes is mine alone, not yours, Signora. Then I apologize, Almighty Shogun. I know, I know, you can't get me out of your mind, but you really don't need to call my name all the time. <laughs> don't go thinking I'm surprised to see you here. I'm well aware that you hate me. With the way you follow me around like a dark shadow. Mm. Ah, so you came to expose my crimes in front of the shogun. <laughs> I'm just a Snezhnayan diplomat. I'm afraid I have no idea what you're talking about. She doesn't take us seriously at all. Hmm. Stop talking about people and things that I care nothing about. They were nobodies to begin with, and their names will be forgotten. Mm -hmm. But now, at least, they get to be building blocks in the grand revolution to realize eternity. Is that not the greatest honor they could hope for in their tiny little lives? Almighty Shogun, do correct me if I'm wrong. Hmm. That's ancient history. <laughs> Certainly love to hold a grudge. Mm -hmm. The Tsaritsa's dream is the noblest and purest thing in all the world. These other mundane details you insist on mentioning, they're just necessary sacrifices. That's all. Mm. You stop me. <laughs> For what it's worth, I've grown tired of seeing you around as well. But I didn't have you down as someone quite so foolhardy. Before you go saying something you can't take back, remember that you're Inazuma's most wanted criminal. Mm. I suggest you consider your circumstances. Very carefully. Mm -hmm. Charging into Tenshukaku uninvited and lecturing me in front of the Shogun wasn't the brightest move. Don't you think it's time you stopped digging? I'm not sure you realize quite how much distance there is between us, both in status and in strength. I challenge you mm. to a duel before the throne. A oh, what? <laughs> Proceed. Mm. My, you're full of surprises today. So you've learned to make the law of the land work for you too. Mm. I'll admit that I never expected to be in a situation where the two of us were on equal footing. You are aware that the loser must die. Are you sure this is what you want? Traveler. <laughs> Then I will deign to share this last dance with you, till death do us part. Mm -hmm. Oh, พูดเหมือนจะแต่งงานกันเลย A lesson on harbinger power and elegance, <laughs> as you wish. เฮ้ยอ้าวเป็นสายฟ้าเหรอเอ้ยไม่ใช่เป็นน้ำแข็งเหรอฮึผมอยากได้ผมอยากได้นี่อยู่เลยไอ้เนี่ยเอ่อนักเวทน้ำแข็งอยู่เลยโอ้โหเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเฮ้ยเ
Stabilized. Good one now. เปลี่ยนเป็นธาตุไฟอะ่ะอ๋อล่างสองเป็นธาตุไฟคริมสันวิชว้าวไม่ใช่เหรอเมื่อกี้ไม่โดนกันเหรอหรือว่าผมต้องตีนี่เรมองเทงโอ้โหสุดยอดสวยสวยมากมาเถอะน้องมาอยู่กับเราเถอะผมอยากได้น้องเหมือนกันนะอืมอ้าวอ้าวเอาเดินผ่านเราไปเฉยเลยนายอินดิฟเฟนต์คุณรู้ว่าอะไรจะเกิดขึ้นถ้าคุณเล่าหน้าตาของนายสวีร์ถ้าคุณฆ่าฉันฉันจะรับผิดชอบ
ตัวละครที่มีสองธาตุเหรอตัวละครที่มีสองธาตุสายฟ้าหางไปตอนนี้ก็เฮ้ยอะไรน่ะนั่นคือ
อันติใช่ไหมเอ้าอีกแล้วอีกแล้วน้องน้องพาเรามามิตินี้มาสู้กันอีกแล้วเหรอบอกว่าต้องบวกกันอ่ะ Indulge my curiosity What is the reason that I find you standing here before me once again Do you hope your foolhardiness will shelter those people Or was it simply a means of seeking an audience with me mm -hmm. Oh <laughs> Surely you didn't rouse me from my state of eternal meditation only to tell me this Mm. If so, then you underestimate me. I am quite well informed about the vision hunt decree. Mm -hmm. Not so. Only everything that pertains to eternity. The vision hunt decree has my tacit approval. The Fatui's actions thus far do not constitute a threat to eternity. Otherwise, they would have been purged long ago. Individual ambition is inherently incompatible with eternity. What you might not realize is that all too often, people have far more to lose by chasing their dreams. Consider this: no one will lose their life on account of having their vision taken away. Rather, those who have lost their lives are the ones who insisted on pursuing their own aspirations. Are they not? Hmm. Traveler. Your existence is unique in my eyes. There seems to be limitless uncertainty in you. To put it another way, you are the furthest thing from eternity. Mm. So I won't insist that you comprehend the meaning of my actions. What matters is that I tread the path of eternity on my people's behalf. That's right. Huh. I'm surprised you understand it so well. Anyway, you're looking for a chance to shake my will, aren't you? Hmm. 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 So be it. Well then, you who would defy eternity, time for you to enlighten me. Hmm. Do you wish to become the enemy of eternity, traveler? Oh, me heal ให้ด้วยขอบใจเลยโดน Feel the same strike dead. Solidify. Come into be. I will no longer be the champion of eternity. Take flight. Chief. ไม่โดนเต็มเต็มเออโอ้ตุ้มตีนี่มาโอ้ลืมเลยอืมอีกแล้วโอ้โหไม่โดนอีกแล้วชิหลบใจนะอืมอะไรเนี่ยอะไรเนี่ยโอ้ใช้ท่าไม่ได้โอ้กรรมละสิโอ้ย
จะแก้ไขสถานะอย่างนี้ยังไงเนี่ยต้องอยู่ได้พักนึงละโทีเดียวพอพอได้ได้พลังเพิ่มมากระจอกไปทีเดียวเลือดอยู่แค่นั้นอ๋อผมก็ไอ้ทำไมไม่ตายวะอ๋อ
Perhaps only if time stands still, will the lightning's glow never fade. The present moment is a fragile illusion. Only eternity can bring us closer to the heavenly principles. Mm -hmm. I am no longer the shadow. Mine is the most supreme and noble form. Let power over the realm be vested within me. In this form shall I honor my subject's dream. For a land of eternity, unchanging forevermore. Mm -hmm. The heavenly principles. Irrelevant nonsense as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. When all's said and done, all you really want is to protect your beloved Inazuma forever and ever. Mm -hmm. Isn't that right? Mm. <sighs> that would be something of an oversimplification. But is this nation worth existing for eternity? Stripped of ambitions, stripped of the potential for change. It does nothing more than simply... exist. It is a hollow shell of a nation. Hmm. I wonder what loss would it really be to anyone if such a nation were destroyed? Miko, retract your words. Never changing eternity is the promise I made to my people. But what your people need from you is not your promises. They want your attention. Mm -hmm. Your divine gaze. <laughs> you mean visions? Humans have a lifespan of barely a hundred years. They cannot afford to bear any extra losses. But I have experienced it all. That is why I have chosen to guide them along the correct path toward eternity. <sighs> But eternity is far too cruel a fate for you, eh? <laughs> for me? Not only have you stopped paying attention to the world, but you have stopped paying attention to yourself. It must have been terribly lonely here, all alone, for centuries on end. But it is necessary. You will miss much by refusing progress. You seek to prevent loss. But have you considered all you are losing by remaining here in stasis for all eternity? You are obviously lonely. And yet, for the sake of eternity, you choose to stretch your loneliness out to infinity. Tell me this. Why is the sky here that was once so dark glowing again? Why now? This is your plane of Euthymia. It's your inner world. So it can only mean... That you are happy to see me again. You have found the loneliness here unbearable for a long time now, haven't you? I... Uh, have nothing to say to that. Mm. <laughs> but I have so much to say to you. Let me tell you all that has happened over the last few centuries. Oh. <laughs> How long will that take? As a fox envoy, I have an excellent memory. I recall every detail of the last few centuries with perfect clarity. Mm -hmm. So it will probably take me another few centuries to relay it to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Miko, I never thought I would have the chance to meet with you like this again. <sighs> Seeing you again is a change to eternity. And a very nice surprise. <laughs> Since you are willing to admit that, I suppose that means we can still be friends? <laughs> what a childish conversation this is. Mm -hmm. Anyway, now that I have been defeated by you and your plan, I will honor your wish to abolish the Vision Hunt Decree. But, with regards to eternity, and the question of whether this nation should move forward, I need time to give it some thought. <laughs> you are the one who's been acting like a child from the very beginning. <laughs> As promised, the Raiden Shogun abolished the Vision Hunt Decree. Mm -hmm. Finally, her people's wishes penetrated her locked heart. Beyond the plane of Euthymia, she saw what eternity means in the eyes of the world. So, yeah. 
When one's fervent ambition burns brightly, the gods will cast their gaze upon you. Some ambitions have the power to heal wounds, to bring victory, to inspire hope. But some ambitions outlive their masters long after the soul ascends. They remain as they were in the beginning. Burning bright and true. Mm. For all eternity. เฮ้ยยังกลับมาได้จริงดิเอออ้าวอืมส่วนเราอืมเอา้ามันก็ล้างเหรออืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอ
all over to that and the time has come for the inazuma leg of your trip to come to an end has it not mm. as a mark of my gratitude i will answer any questions you may have about the road ahead or the events of the past what would you like to know about mm. oh hey job la la ting ah that puppet was built with technology that has been lost to time. Oh. Perhaps she, as a god, is the only one privy to the knowledge of its origins. Oh. Still, there is one other thing on this topic that I suspect you may be curious to know. Before A began modifying her own godly form, she took it upon herself to create a prototype puppet. Mm. So, you mean there are three riding shokens? Mm -hmm. No. Hmm? The prototype was merely a proof of concept. Oh. Its appearance and intellect were not based on A. It was a test. The original plan was for A to simply discard it. But perhaps A thought this to be too cruel, because in the end she chose only to seal the power within it. Oh. Later, this puppet wandered Inazuma as an ordinary human male with his own consciousness. Until the Fatui took an interest in him. Oh. Uh. Fatui. Some eccentric geniuses in the ranks of the Fatui made adjustments to the prototype, not only unsealing his power, but very likely rendering him even more formidable than his original specifications. Hmm. Mm -hmm. The object of divine creation is now the one who has taken possession of the Gnosis, mm. and the prototype puppet is now known as the Balladeer. What? Mm. Mm -hmm. It is, isn't it? Who can say whether it's coincidence or destiny? Then I'm gonna pump got a chokun hun chert, but I see me. Chokun lighter, kun kun kun. I'm surprised an outlander like you is aware that there was once a change of Electro Archon. Mm -hmm. Few citizens of Inazuma are aware of this. Morax told us he said that the Electro Archon ball had passed away. Yes. The truth of the matter is that there were two twin gods, Baal and Beelzebul. Oh, twin gods? They won the Archon War together, and when Baal established the Shogunate, Beelzebul became her Kagemusha, or Shadow Warrior. Mm. In other words, she acted as Baal's body double. Mm. Beelzebul is A, with whom we are now both acquainted. Mm. Baal's name was Makoto. As far as the world was aware, there were not two, but one. They complemented each other, and they ruled Inazuma jointly. So there was no need for the public to know the truth. In fact, the name Ball and the title of Raiden Shogun was understood to refer to both of them. Right up until... Until what? Makoto died several hundred years ago in a war that I was not personally involved in. Mm. Since then, A has assumed the Shogunate. Losing her sister must have been super hard on A. Mm. That was when A began to change. Makoto was her greatest loss. Paimon mm. feels like she understands A a lot better now after finding that out. So what kind of god was Makoto? I didn't spend a great deal of time with her, but my impression was she was a gentle god, who in each moment cherished the beauty of what was before her. Mm. Wow! Sorry. I haven't a clue. No. I'm also unfamiliar with the god you describe. Mm. But if you still have doubts about A, I would say they are misplaced. Not only does she not fit your description, but she voluntarily gave up her gnosis long ago, severing her ties with Celestia in the process. That's good to hear. Otherwise, given that I'm her familiar, it could have made our relationship rather awkward, don't you think? Mm -hmm. Don't worry, we aren't looking to pick a fight with you. <laughs> I wish you the best of luck. 
may you soon discover the truth behind it all. Mm -hmm. As for your sister's whereabouts, I will use all the resources at my disposal to investigate it. And I will also borrow some of Ayato's people from the Shiumatsuban. I'll let you know if I find out anything. Consider it part of my means of thanking you. Mm -hmm. After leaving Inazuma, hmm, I think it would be easiest for you to go to Sumeru. Journey so far. Yeah. Yes, well, yeah. Sumeru is the land of the god of wisdom, where the quest for wisdom and knowledge is never ending. But their obsession gives rise to some truly inexplicable things. For example, in Sumeru, knowledge is holistically managed as a resource. Knowledge is a resource? Yes. I don't know whether it was the sages or lesser lord Kusanali who came up with the idea. Lesser Lord Kusanali? Mm. That's a cute name. Oh, you haven't heard. Lesser Lord Kusanali is the deity in whom the people of Sumeru place their faith. It's their chosen term of endearment for her. I'm sure you must have some things to discuss with her too. Mm. I wish you all the best. Mm. Are you sure? Okay then. Oh, traveler. Do you still have the omamori I gave you? Hmm. Keep it safe. Is that all you intend to do with it? There was me thinking that you might hang it around your neck to show off to the world, <laughs> telling everyone who inquired that it was given to you by none other than Yai Miko, the wise and beautiful. <laughs> who in their right mind would do that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Now, a question for you. Traveler, what is your ambition? Mm. I see. But that is merely a small goal, based on what preoccupies you here and now. Your ambition should be something that transcends the world below and the starry sky above. Something that shines in unison with fate itself. Perhaps the reason you do not possess a vision is that such an ambition has yet to be engendered within you. Mm. It's a possibility. Continue on your journey, and maybe that moment will come to pass. Hmm. Dead boy. Hmm. Okay, ครับ. ก่อนนะก็คงแค่นี้แล้ว. เราไว้ค่อยเจอกันอีกทีในคลิปๆหน้านะครับ. สำหรับ